Get close up, I'll get video. Yeah. Welcome to Touche. This is the second annual Mr. Midwest Rubber Contest. Hopefully that's all what you're here for. Yes? Everybody knew that? Anybody surprised? I see some shiny guys out there, which is always a good thing. So, uh, my name is Rubber Willie. Uh, for those of you who don't know me, uh, I was Mr. International Rubber 2003, and now I kind of run the Mr. International Rubber Contest, which is, some people think it's a conflict of interest. I personally don't think it's a conflict of interest. I have no, no power over the winner here tonight, and no power over the winner in November. So, although last year I did have power over the winner, because I was a judge last year here. So, but anyway, that's besides the point. So, welcome once again to the uh, second annual Mr. Midwest Rubber Contest. Uh, we're going to get things going here. I am not a comedic wit. Um, I would like to think that I might be Kathy, Differ Kathy Griffin, my life on the D list, D being for Dick, because um, I love Dick. Everybody, who loves Dick here in this room? Yeah, who knew? Everybody liked Cheney. I didn't know that. So, oh no, not Cheney. Um, so we're going to try and, my goal is to run a quick and efficient contest. Who likes quick and efficient contests? Because that way you get to play afterwards, right? We all like to play afterwards. And if they strip rubber dress code to get in the back room tonight, right, David? Strict gear. 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 Gear dress code. You have to be in gear. And it's a strict gear dress code. So your Ralph Lauren polo penny loafers are not going to get you in the back room tonight. Sorry. Uh, so Mr. Midwest Rubber is sponsored by Touche, a lovely bar which we yeah! Vex Clothing, which is a local latex manufacturer here in Chicago. Laura is an absolutely wonderful person, and she made Dan's lovely Mountie outfit, which you'll be seeing a little bit later on tonight. And tonight's winter proceeds on to Mr. International Rubber 2008, which is going to be held uh, here in Chicago, November 9th through the 11th. So if you're not familiar with that contest, go online to www.mirubber.com and you can find out all the information. If you want to get into the host hotel, I'm sorry, you're too late, it's already sold out. But there's a secondary hotel, so you can find out information about that. Entry to Mr. International Rubber 2008, once again in November. He's also going to get a $300 gift certificate to Vex here in Chicago to have custom rubber gear made for himself. He's getting a prize package from Touche, which we'll probably hear about a little bit uh, later. Um, and I think that we're just about ready to go. So is our contestant ready? David, do you want to grab our contestant? <laughs> carefully grab him. Don't rupture any of the rubber gear. Ladies and gentlemen, your contestant for Mr. Midwest Rubber, Dante Brasher. get up here and do this, because I don't know why everybody's so scared about it. Is this scary? Not at all. Yeah. It's fun. I mean, I think it'd be more fun if there were other guys competing with you, because you get naked downstairs with them and shine them up and all that stuff, so. Okay. So, oh, David will get naked with you. Anybody else want to get naked with Dante? Are you? Oh, other, somebody said they already have. We'll talk about that in a few minutes here. Uh, so the first category of judging tonight is rubber image. So the judges here are going to be looking at Dante to see how he wears his gear, if he looks comfortable in it, do they think this really represents who he is as a rubber man, etc. And while they're looking, and Dante is modeling, I'm going to tell you a little bit about Dante. Uh, let's see, email. I shouldn't probably tell your email right away. That would be bad. Uh, Dante is 29 years old. He's six foot two and weighs 170 pounds. He's single. So if anybody's looking, Dante's available. Uh, Dante, top, bottom, versatile. The chemistry, okay? It depends on the chemistry of the person. And so it's just in that action. So the judges have formatted the question they want Dante to answer. And the thing that they're looking for here in this component is how well does Dante present himself to the audience? How well does he hold your attention? And can he at least 
hold the microphone and answer the question in some sensible manner. So, Dante, this is your question. A local charity is holding a celebrity drag contest. You've been invited as the new Mr. Midwest Rubber. Rubber Willie will be there, and he's going as Kathy Griffin from My Life on the Dick List. Who will you attend in drag? So, you're going to a celebrity drag contest. Who are you going to attend as? I must attend that drag event as pretty much. Do you guys have okay? Yes. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to attend this drag event with Rubber Willie, and I'm excited to go with Cher. She's tall, good looking, long black hair, and hey, she's a good match for me, so I'm going to go with Cher. Can you do a hair flip for us, a Cher hair flip? Again, we're off, going off track again. So, okay. So that was our first two categories. Judges, Dante, do a little spin, turn around, so everyone can see the shininess, the tightness, the slipness. Judges, are we good? Yes. Okay. No. Who said no? I'm getting protests from the judges already. Right. Imagine if there were five contestants. Oh, we'd be here all night. All good? Yes. Okay. So we're going to let Dante go now. He's going to go downstairs and get changed for our next category, which is the physique category, in which Dante will be showing you a little bit more skin. So, Dante, thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear for Dante. The man with the ball is So, because we only had one contestant tonight, and the judges wanted to put the contestant through their paces, they also set the bar that our contestant had to get at least 70% of the total score. So, the score has been tallied, and our contestant received 87% of the total score. So, congratulations, Dante. You are Mr. Midwest Rubber 2007. The rubber guys don't really do vests. Vests don't really work with rubber. Uh, so, Mr. Dan set the tone with Mr. Midwest rubber gauntlets. Which he doesn't have on tonight, but you will have a pair of Mr. Midwest rubber gauntlets made for you that say NWR 2007. So, he will get that. And he's also getting injury to Mr. International Rubber 2007 in November. So, study up, get ready. for custom tailored rubber from Vex Clothing and a prize package from Touche. So, ladies and gentlemen, you're Mr. Midwest Rubber 2007 and 2006, Dante and Dan. Photo ops, all the press, everyone with the camera who needs photos, this is your time. Thank you all for coming out and supporting the second annual version of this.